Hey guys, Sasha from Mobile Geeks here. It's the very last day of Google I.O. 2013 and finally got some time to show you a little bit around. And what I would love to show you is one of the most famous Google service, which is obviously Google Maps and especially Google Street View. So I'm sure that you're all familiar with this one over here. It all started with the Google car or the Street View car that were driving over streets and countries all over the world, right? And um, just to show you a little bit about the technique here, you can see this amazing camera. I think it's like eight lenses or something like that. Just kind of shooting videos into all directions. And um, of course, there's a proper system in there. This looks like a little, like a mini ITX or whatever, a little desktop system. Comes here with a desktop so that the driver can also see what, what he is filming. Um, besides the street view car, they have a street view snowmobile, which is pretty cool. Um, so if you're going to travel to Antarctica and you want to know how the environment looks like, uh, I can already tell you it's white, um, they are going to use the snowmobile to yeah, just kind of map and take pictures of all of Antarctica or Canada or Alaska or whatever. But you know what, let's, let's move on. Here we have the street view trike because I mean there are so many places and little small side alleys and lanes um, that are just too narrow to drive through with the car and therefore they have the street view trike which is quite interesting. I mean I love all this. This is like super geeky. I would like to have this on my ordinary car. Well, not this huge camera, because I'm pretty sure that this is heavy as hell. Oh, you know what? That's okay. Oh, look at this. They have a generator in here from Honda. Just to make sure. I don't even know about the power consumption of this camera, but I would guess um, it really draws quite some juice. Let's take a look in here. You may see that's the same small, little, compact, um, mini desktop server system uh, with a hot plug 3.5 inch drive bay so you can get your hard disk in there and yeah that's how it looks like last but not least just follow me um, we also know that Google Maps has uh, some well that's not street view anymore right they have this interview of, of places and especially museums and so They've invented the street view trolley that they're sending to museums all over the world so that you guys can do your virtual museum round trip. But that's not all, because last but not least, there's also a kind of set up gear for the special Google Street View man, and we're going to take a look at it upstairs. So here we have the Street View Tracker, which is, I can't really say that this is comfy to wear at all, because it's kind of weird and very heavy on the top. And as you can see the camera there, this uh, consists of, I think, like 16 lenses. And by the way, this is running on an Android device. How much does this weigh? <laughs> you tell about, us. It's about 36 pounds. 36 pounds, is it? And, Trust me, you really have to work for your money if you're a street view tracker. <laughs>